compared to 2013, Red Stripe was paying very high prices on electricity import. Um, the electricity costs for Red Stripe were the second highest input cost next to malt, which is the raw material used to make the beer. So in 2013, we embarked on what we call the transformational projects for Red Stripe. The, the combined heat and power plant was one of those projects which included two gas engines from Caterpillar that were the main components of the plant. During the first three years of the plant's operation, we had used an overseas company to service the engines for us. We made the ultimate choice to go to the local Caterpillar dealer, Imco, to provide all the spares, all the service, based on what our needs were. I'm certified by Caterpillar in, in, in combined heat and power and, and CG engines, Caterpillar gas engines. We were looking at other avenues in terms of where we should actually go with the business. Came to find out that there were a couple of companies in Jamaica, Red Stripe being one of them, who had CHP combined heat and power level two engines. When I actually came to, down to Red Stripe, I saw that they were a company who required support. There was a good selection of people who were within IMCA who had more than the technical ability to actually transition from sulfur engines to, to CHP or gas engines. And from then on, we actually got them certified. We had them sent to Atlanta. And when we came back here, that was it. We just went straight into work. The customer actually started to have confidence in us. How we actually performed the work, how we actually finished the job, how we actually ordered our parts and the level of technical expertise which we supplied the customer outside of the job in terms of giving them guidance, what way to go, what to do, what not to do, training the whole shebang. Working with IMCA, I must say, it's been one of the easier suppliers to deal with, local suppliers. It was more of a partnership and we, we found it very easy to negotiate the terms and conditions. Um, IMCA was very receptive in terms of some of our demands, in terms of especially our own timelines, because Red Stripe usually has very tight timelines. We found the team to be extremely responsive and receptive, and the entire negotiation and contracting process was very smooth. By engaging IMCA, to do the repairs on the engine for us. We noticed a few things, that the spares and service was approximately 20 to 30% cheaper than the overseas supplier. The impact of completing the repair on the CHP plant resulted in a savings of approximately Jamaican $5 million per month or 40,000 US dollars per month in um, reducing the electricity import costs. Having the CHP plant up really reduces the cost of the business and keeps us in business.